Hybrids may be hot sellers, but the truly eco-conscious may soon turn to cars fueled by garbage. Yes, plain old household trash. And it's not as far-fetched as you may think. Through a technology called catalytic depolymerization, garbage is ground up and turned into high-grade diesel fuel. What takes nature millions of years has been sped up to about three minutes, and the fuel can be used by any diesel vehicle. We can take garbage in and correct a lot of the problems with garbage, landfill, uh, tires, all that kind of uh, pollution creating problems. Green Power, the Washington State-based company that developed the technology, says that it can produce fuel for less than a dollar a gallon. The hope is that plants like this one will help win the U.S. energy independence from the Middle East, while at the same time eliminating the nation's burgeoning landfills. This mobile refinery can make fresh diesel on the spot. Plans are to build 1,500 permanent waste-to-fuel plants across the country. It is estimated that one plant alone can produce 85,000 gallons of fuel a day, and that's just from one landfill. We don't live on waste anymore. Waste will be a product and a commodity, what's useful. Saving the environment and tackling high fuel costs is a lofty goal. The company first has to convince landfill operators that the technology is cost effective. The first plant will be built in Fife, Washington, and another one is slated in Montana, and the company is in talks with other cities across the U.S. This is Jack Hambrick reporting.